Food Shopping in a Time of Pandemic by Robert Cooperman We're two of the lucky ones, our groceries delivered, though feelings of guilt it's so easy, while so many suffer food insecurity, a polite way of saying they go hungry, have to risk their health, their lives, to shop in supermarkets. But as I said, we're among the lucky ones, the ones with money, with credit cards, the ones who don't have to venture out like mice fearing the cat's lurking jaws, the ones who can order cookies, pecan tarts, ice cream, not just vegetables, provisions to make stews that last all week, who can call up the local pizzeria, the catering service, and pretend nothing strange and dreadful has occurred, that hundreds of thousands haven't died from COVID, gasping, alone, terrified, that others haven't been shot or choked by the police, and that other pandemic, because they're black, which in America seems to be a capital offense. So yes, we don't have to worry about being murdered, about empty bellies, about not having chocolate chip cookies for three o'clock snack time.